Guys, you've probably used note-taking apps before, but what if your notes could actually think with you? I'm Daniel. Welcome to my channel, where I make smart tutorials. Today, we're diving into AI Go Note, an AI-powered platform that does way more than just organized text. We're going to test its most powerful features, including templates for meetings, study notes, and research tools. Also, I've left all the useful links in the description down below, so don't forget to check them out. Let's jump in and see how it works. All right, my friends, let's take a look at AI Go Note, a cutting-edge AI-powered platform for creating and managing notes. AI Go Note uses artificial intelligence to automatically turn different types of content into organized, editable notes. It offers several main ways to create notes, which we'll go through in detail. First up, you can work with audio, either by recording it yourself or uploading files. You can also import PDFs, upload text or scan documents, guys. There's even an option to transcribe YouTube videos to turn them into notes. Let's try recording an audio note. I'll start by picking the language for our note, give the app access to the microphone, and then start recording. This is a pretty lengthy note on machine learning applications. As you can see, folks, it ended up being almost two minutes long. Now I'll save the audio recording I just made. You can see that the recording uploads and starts processing. This is a basic AI Go Note feature for creating audio notes. Basically, it can turn any audio recording into a full, structured note. All right, the note is ready, let's open it and see what we've got inside. And as you can see, guys, it includes the audio recording plus some useful features we can play with. Down below, there's a complete, well-structured summary of the note. Let's check out the tools available. By clicking More Options, we see that all the features are organized into main categories, displayed at the top. Each category has specialized templates for different use cases. Folks, let's start with the Meetings category, designed for handling notes from calls and meetings. Here there are several templates. In a single tab, we can generate a meeting summary that pulls key points from our notes and details, everything that happened during the meeting. Follow-up emails can be drafted automatically after meetings, and the presentation template helps prepare notes and slides for talks or presentations. Let's try out this feature and see how it works, guys. And there you go. As you can see, for presentations, you get several ready-made sections that you can use right away. In the one-on-one -on -one category, you can handle personal meetings and one-on-one -on -one sessions. The stand-up template is perfect for quick daily check-ins for Agile teams. Interview notes help you capture details from interviews, while brainstorming is great for generating creative ideas. Discussion notes let you organize key discussion points efficiently. In the study category, there are templates for learning purposes, folks. Study notes help keep your educational notes organized. Bullet notes create structured bullet point lists. Let's check out bullet notes. You can see it generates clear, organized lists based on your note content. Cornell notes are another option, designed for structured note taking using the Cornell method. Feynman method is for explaining complex concepts in simple, easy to understand language. So simple that even a school student could get it. Using this method, you can clearly break down even the most complicated notes. Take a look, guys. When we check a note using Feynman method, you can see it's divided into categories, and the content is really explained in plain, digestible language. Next, there's Zettelkasten notes, which help create connected notes and build a knowledge base. Reading notes are for taking notes while reading. Lesson Planner is pretty self-explanatory, as well as Weekly Planner. It helps organize your week and schedule. In the Research section, you get academic and analytical tools. Lit Review helps with reviewing academic papers and literature efficiently. Folks, deep research is for diving into topics and conducting thorough analysis. SWOT analysis helps you evaluate strengths, weaknesses, opportunities, and threats. Data tables let you organize information neatly in table format. In the creation section, you get tools for generating content. Content outline helps you build a starting structure for your content. Resume builder creates resumes, highlighting skills and experience. Blog writing helps you draft full blog posts. And video script lets you create scripts for videos. For example, guys, using blog writing, you can get a complete article with a topic, an introduction with quotes, numbered and unnumbered lists, main content, relevant categories, and hashtags. Basically a ready-to-go post. 
You can also use Polish to improve and edit your text. It shows a preview of the polished content, which you can tweak and then publish. The transcript feature lets you see your note in text mode. You can listen to the recording right there and spot all the key points easily. The quiz feature lets you create text-based questionnaires from your notes. Folks, you'll see ready-made questions that you can answer to test your knowledge. Mind map helps you visualize information. You can explore the map and use it fully to organize ideas. Flashcards let you create cards for memorization. You can flip through them and answer questions to practice memorizing information. Translate lets you convert your note into a different language. For example, folks, you can take a note in English and create a full German version. Edit Note allows you to manually edit your notes with tools to improve text, transcribe audio, and highlight key points. These are the main features of AI Go Note, guys. As you can see, we now have a fully translated note in German, ready to use. We can also use another way to upload notes. Let's try uploading a PDF, guys. I'm taking a medical document to showcase this powerful feature, which basically allows you to interact with the content by chatting with it. The PDF is a complex medical report on a patient's mental capacity, with lots of technical details. Once we upload it, AI Go Note prepares it for interactive use. Now the document is uploaded, and we can view the summary. We can see the patient's name, ID and age. There is info about the doctor in charge, and observations about the patient's condition. And at the bottom, folks, there is a chat where we can ask the smart assistant questions about the document. For example, we can ask, summarize the patient's cognitive assessment results from the mental status examination. And within seconds, the bot has the answer for us. Or we can try another question. What is the patient's diagnosis and medical history? And the app then provides a full clear summary. Again, super fast, guys. I'll ask a couple more questions about the doctor's findings and the patient's prognosis and get a detailed answer. The app does that quickly and efficiently. We can also ask about clinical guidelines, and here's an example of the response. As you can see, the app doesn't just store the PDF file. It turns it into an intelligent knowledge base. Folks, the system understands medical terminology, the document's structure, and can answer complex analytical questions. It also supports folder organization. You can create different folders for different areas, for example, medical professionals can organize their files by patient. This is especially useful for doctors, lawyers, researchers, and students. Anyone working with large volumes of technical information no longer needs to manually search through long documents. Instead, my friends, you can simply ask questions in natural language and get answers instantly. All right, guys, that's AI Go Note in action. Honestly, I'm impressed by how much it can do, from turning audio into clean notes, to handling PDFs like a pro, and even giving you smart templates for meetings, studying, and research. It's not just a note-taking app, it's like having a personal assistant that actually understands your content. If you want to give it a try, I've dropped the link in the description for you. Go check it out, folks, and let me know what feature you'd use the most. Is it the meeting templates, the study tools, or the PDF Q&A? If you're excited to try it out, or if you've already used it and have some thoughts to share, drop a comment below. I'd love to hear your experiences. Don't forget to hit that like button if you found this video helpful and subscribe for more tutorials. Thanks for watching, until next time.